The Cleveland Indians have displayed tremendous offense in the first three games at the new Yankee Stadium and have used that to dig out of an 0-5 start they experienced. New York was looking for the series split with the Tribe, so out to the Bronx we go. We take you on early in the game, Shinsu Chu at the plate, top half of the second inning, and Chu leaves the yard for his third home run of the year. Balls continue to fly out of the new Yankee Stadium. Now Robinson Cano up bottom of the second here with a ground out. Carl Pavano in his return to the Bronx, six straight outs. Top half of the fourth inning, Ryan Garko, he too would leave the yard, his first of the year. Chu was on base, also scoring with him, 3 nothing. Indians. Bottom of the fourth, Mark Desher at the plate, and he rips a single into right field. That would score Derek Jeter, so the Yankees are on the board, trailing out 3 one. Bottom of the seventh, Hideki Matsui, he comes through with a single into center field. It's now 3-2, to two, New York trails with Robinson Cano scoring. Bottom of the seventh, New York down one. The pinch hitter is Jorge Posada. Watch this. It's going to land right near the first row. Umpires would eventually converge and discuss this play. After instant replay was used, it was confirmed that the Yankee home run would stand, and the Yankee lead is now 4-3. to three. Bases loaded, bottom of the eighth inning, and at this point, Cody Ransom lifts one down the left field line. It appears as if it might have got lost in the sun because that's a fair ball. The bases are now empty. It's a 7-3 Yankee lead. They would go on to win it by that score. New York 7, Cleveland 3. The two teams split the four-game series. The first series played at the New Yankee Stadium. For New York, they will continue the homestand by taking on the Oakland A's, but a 7-3 victory over Cleveland in the Bronx.